I was diagnosed in county jail. When I first was that I was diagnosed, it was it was really hard. Even though I put myself at risk, at a really high risk. I mean, I never thought it would happen to me. When you're transgender in prison, you you right away your mind goes into this mode that I know what I have to do to survive. When I started transitioning and taking my hormones, it's like I started feeling different. And I started liking who I was. And it's like, I'm a different person. I mean, even though I'm HIV positive, that it doesn't stop me no more. It doesn't, I'm not afraid anymore. And I want other people to learn that it is okay to live with HIV. It is okay to be accepted. One of the hardest thing is when you first get diagnosed, right? So you have to deal with that shame. You have to deal with meeting doctors, meeting people, uh, getting appointments. And your first reaction comes with like, how are they gonna look me? How are they gonna judge me? Am I gonna get criticized? Are they gonna say things after I leave? Being on the other side now, it's, it's a learning experience every day. I started volunteer at, at the agency where I was a client. For me to, to speak with them is really easy. That's what got me that job, that understanding, that caring, the honesty, the sincerity, and just the fact to be trusted again. It was amazing, an amazing experience for me to get this job.